went on and my dad and I started to, you know, sketch out ideas for, for doing a, a book on this. And um, as it turns out, uh, he died on Christmas Eve of 2006 at the age of 90, about three weeks short of his 91st birthday. And this is one of, you know, this is one thing my father really wanted to have done. It wasn't for publicity purposes, but he believed that the telling of his story would bring a measure of justice to the case. Anyway, but I held my dad's hand um, and said, Dad, I, you know, I'm going to take up your investigation and someday tell your story to the world. And at this point, he was too weak to speak. But he he looked up into my eyes and smiled and squeezed my hand, and I knew he was happy. So that, Meg, is how I got involved in this story.